Do you and Greg are co-workers? No, nah, we friends. Dude's terrified of calling somebody his friend. Dude's got issues. But how are you co-workers? We make films. Movies? They're terrible. Greg, you never told me. A new movie with an odd name won high praise at the Sundance Film Festival. LaToya met the director and one of the actors from the movie, Me and Earl and the Dying Girl. Both have Texas ties. Take a look. So if this was a touching romantic story, our eyes would meet and suddenly we would be furiously making out with the fire of a thousand suns. But this isn't a touching romantic story. Anyway. Yep. Nope. Me and Earl and the Dying Girl is not that kind of movie. I like the fact that there was no real romance in the film. It kind of uh, it fo it forces the movie to focus on different kind of subject matter, and um, and it's really about just the kind of insecurity of, of teenagers and the selfishness of them. Don't go through my stuff. We discussed it, and she gets to go through your stuff. Thomas Mann, a Plano native, plays Greg Gaines, a socially awkward senior who would rather make films than friends. His mom forces him to spend time with Rachel, a classmate recently diagnosed with cancer. Rachel Kushner has been diagnosed with leukemia. You might be someone who could make Rachel feel better. And there's not a lot of people like him. You know, he likes weird, obscure films that he makes with this kid named Earl, who he refers to as his coworker. He won't even call him his friend. Rachel, I don't really know you, but I believe in you. Together, the unlikely trio make a film for Rachel. They also learn tough lessons about life and dying. Director Alfonso Gomez Rejon, who grew up in Laredo, says this project was personal for him because one of his loved ones battled cancer. Because I was an adult and I couldn't handle it, and I was going through something, and I felt, uh, I, 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 so I really identified with Greg's journey, and I wanted to take it with him. He was, gonna, he was much more courageous than I was. It's okay that, uh, to be confused and to be in denial, um, but it's, 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 it's also okay to deal with it um, through humor. He hopes audiences get it. Me and Earl and the Dying Girl has already caught the attention of people in the film community. It won the grand prize and audience award at the Sundance Film Festival. Now the film that two Texans poured their hearts into hopes to win you over. LaToya Silman, Fox 4 News.